So it is a really nasty day today and I'm definitely not getting in the water. So my plan was to go to the jewelry store and get this gold chain of praise that I found on Starnes Island. If you didn't see that video, I'm gonna put the link to it right here. And afterwards, when I get home, I'm gonna to attempt to contact the owner of the watertight foam pouch that I found on the Guadalupe River a few weeks back. But for now, let's head downtown, let's see what this bad boy's worth. It is such a nasty day. And I also did want to mention too that the manager of uh, Kruger's Diamond Jewelry was kind enough to allow me to bring my camera in and get this done as well. So I figured they deserve a nice little shout out. That is probably silver. Would be my guess. This is the way it's tarnished. It's probably silver. And this. Scott is getting nervous. <laughs> this is stamped 18 karat. That's the quality stamp on it. Um, okay. But. Um, yeah, it's not 18 karat. It's not 18 karat? No. No. It's not good. Oh, right. man. I don't, I don't, I don't think it's <laughs> we pulled it out of the mud and put it out of like six inches of mud and there's no corrosion on it. Well, it's gold plated. Yeah. So, but that, that's it, that's going to prevent it from... Um, from that hurts. Um, get a chain like this in 18 karat. It's going to weigh, it's going to feel heavier. Yeah. You know, and... Um, so, I mean, I just think it's plated. Okay. And this is silver, and those are diamonds. Those are diamonds? Yeah, but they're, you know, they're what you might call inconsequential diamonds. Okay. Because to take those out and try to do something with them uh, is going to cost you more money than the diamonds are worth. Okay. So, you know, Wow. Uh, but they are diamonds. But they are diamonds. That's the exact opposite of what I thought. So we're back here at the house. I'm about to call Cameron. She's the owner of that pouch that I found in the Guadalupe River. So let's call her and figure out exactly what happened the day that she lost it. I actually contacted her boyfriend, Evan, and he was able to give me her contact information. So let's go ahead and give her a call and see what happened. Hey, so my name is Scott. Um, I actually found some items of yours in the Guadalupe River a few weeks ago and I was wondering if you're missing looks like a pink iPhone along with um, your ID Evan's ID and some debit cards <laughs> yeah that sounds like something I've missed at some point just out of curiosity how long ago did this happen probably last summer awesome cool so you lost this about a year ago and I'm sure, I'm sure everything that you lost, you probably already replaced, but are you interested at all in me mailing this stuff back to you? Evan, he's been super concerned about trying to figure out if there's any way to get those photos. Like the photos that we had taken that day, I already told him that those were long gone though. Well, that's good. Yeah, you can definitely recover your photographs off this phone. I didn't try to turn it back on. Um, it had, uh, so the pouch leak, and it had a, it, when I opened it up, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, it smelled terrible. And it definitely had some sort of, yeah, it definitely had some sort of mold or something inside of it. But I'm sure that there's some sort of way you can get the photographs off this phone. I didn't really try too hard to turn it back on. I didn't want to fry it or something. Oh, I don't, I don't like it. It's definitely all here. If you want, you just text me that address and I'll, I'll go ahead and put it in the mail to you. Okay, sounds good. Thank you so much. So that is that. That pretty much wraps up the video for today. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. We've got an amazing video coming out very soon. I'm taking my underwater camera into a really beautiful freshwater spring that is loaded full of endangered and really rare animals. And if you want to see some photography that I took in this location, go ahead and check me out on Instagram. It's scottbauer79. I'll go ahead and put the handle on my description below. Don't forget to hit that like button and I'll see you on the next video.